guys, so today I have a new video for you, and this is going to be a shop walk video. Um, so I'm just going to show you some items that I bought um, at the drugstore yesterday. Um, I've actually already tried filming this video like three times, I guess. Yeah, about three times. Um, but basically it always kind of fails. Um, either there were like too many noises outside, or the angle wasn't that good, or I don't know. So this is hopefully going to be the final time. Um, I'm also not at my usual location because I'm actually at my grandma's house right now. Um, so yeah, that's kind of like why the background looks a little different. But I want to film this video um, anyway. So yeah, let's get started. Um, I also did close the window. Um, but you might still hear some cars outside. Um, but yeah, hopefully it won't be too loud because in the previous video there was quite a few like cars driving by and it was quite loud so that's why I wanted to reform it and you can maybe still hear it like a little bit but as long as it's not like super loud that it startles you I think it's alright so yeah um I'm gonna start with the first item which are these um makeup wipes and these are just in the drugstore like I said everything is just in the drugstore um and um there are 10 makeup wipes in here as you can see um and um I need some noises. These are actually um, really good for traveling because there's only 10 wipes in here. Um, I actually also brought a pack of these to my grandma's house where I'm at right now because I'm staying here for like a few days. So these are actually really great um, to remove makeup. Also for eye makeup they're good. Um, so personally I actually do um, quite like them. Um, they're also very cheap. These were only like 99 cents, I think. Um, and um, there's also no alcohol in here, which is also great, obviously, because alcohol isn't too good for your skin. Um, if you like use it too much, um, it can kind of like dry out your skin, so yeah. But um, these are definitely some nice makeup vibes. So, um, and I'm going to be using these when I'm going on vacation. Um, so yeah, I'm going to put these aside and then let's go over to the next item. Um, so I'll just pick this as the next item, which is the um, MUA uh, Makeup Academy Brow, Brow Define Tinted Brow Mascara. <laughs> okay, that's kind of a long name. Um, yeah, as you can see here, it's kind of difficult if I hold something close to the camera, it's kind of like blurry. I don't know, it doesn't really like focus, so I'm not really gonna do that. Um, but this is in the color Fair, and this is just a tinted um, brown mascara. And then if you can hear the tapping. My nails are a little bit longer, as you can see, so it's nice to tap on items. Um, yeah, this is just an eyebrow gel. And the brushes, as you can see, like quite big. Um, I also have like an essence tinted eyebrow gel, and that brush is definitely a lot uh, smaller. But um, yeah, I think it's nice. I've already tried it out. The color over here looks a little bit like kind of beige almost. It doesn't even. It almost looks like a concealer color. Um, but if you like put it on in your eyebrows, it actually does look um, nice and actually like. If you first put it on, it looks a little bit like you're putting concealer in your eyebrows, or at least it's kind of like what looked like on my eyebrows, but it actually did kind of like dry down, and then it just looked really nice and just like a blonde color, so yeah, it does work really well, and I do like this eyebrow gel, um, and this one was in sale for $1.75, so it's also really affordable, so yeah, that was the first one. Then I also did buy... Um, some products by Essence. Um, the first one that I got is this um, Essence Sculpting Eye Pencil and this is in the color 03 Grape Rose. It says it over here on the label. And here it's like Sculpting Eye Pencil. Um, so you have a like light side which is kind of like a champagne color and also a darker side which is um, kind of like a purple shade. Um, I think this is actually also the best spot for lighting because I think you can actually kind of see the like the light kind of change the color of the pencil. I mean, there's like some shimmer in it so we kind of like see the switch of like the shimmer. Um, I think it's actually the best location that I could have filmed it because it's right in front of the window so yeah, I don't know. Because this is a like dark eye pencil, but, like a dark purple eye pencil but it actually has 
some like burgundy pinkish shimmer in it which I think is really really pretty and this one is just like a really shimmery metallic-ish almost um like um like a champagne gray-ish like but it's like still like a warm gray I guess so it's like a champagne color I'll also swatch it for you and if you can hear the cap you know and then the other side, I'll switch it next with. So, yeah. I don't know if you can really see it, but. Okay, it's like slightly too much light. Maybe if it kind of like. Yeah, I guess it kind of works better. So, this is obviously the champagne color, and that is the purple shade. So, they're both very pigmented and pretty. And um, yeah, I actually also today used the. Um, lighter shade in my inner corner and it is very like pretty and pigmented and um yeah definitely lights up your eyes um and the last item that i bought they only bought like four items um so this is already the last one is this essence contouring eyeshadow set um which is basically just a little palette with two eyeshadow colors And this is in the color 03 brownies with frosting. Um, so you get like a brown shade, which I think sense for the brownies. And then this is supposed to be the frosting. <laughs> if you look at the name. Um, so yeah. So this is a lighter shade, which is also says imprinted in like the product. It says number one highlight and then two contour um, so you get like a light highlight shade and a kind of a contour shade um, which I was personally kind of still looking for a smaller eyeshadow palette like this um, that I can kind of like use when I go on vacation or when I have to do my makeup on the go like when I do my makeup in the car or in the train or something and I don't really want to take um, like a huge palette with like 10 shades or something because I don't really have any like small eyeshadow palettes um, so yeah this one's actually really great for that um, so yeah, I'm just gonna swatch it and show you the colors. The pigmentation isn't like amazing, um, but I think it is still quite nice. Um, okay, now it actually looks kind of bad. Oh, kind of swatched it a little bit bad, but you can see the pigmentation isn't too amazing. Um, the swatches are also like a little bit bad, but yeah. It's not like super pigmented, but I guess if you use it with the brush, it can be kind of different because I don't use the other my eyes, so I don't really know, but um, yeah, I think it does look pretty. There's not that much fallout, like a little bit. Um, but yeah, I think the colors are nice. And I also do have like a um, eyeshadow, like pencil, like a crayon type of thing. So I can kind of use it in combination with these and with the pencil. And it's like really handy for if I go on like a little trip or if I go on, if I have to do my makeup on the go or something. And it's handy to have like some products like that. So. Yeah, um, and I think this palette, I don't really know the exact price, I think it was like $2.59 maybe? And the pencil, I don't know, I think it was like one something, um, I don't remember that. Um, but it's all like affordable, so yeah. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video, I um, think this is definitely the best video that I filmed of all of them. Because there's not that much background noises, there's nothing like loud. Um, in the background, it's like startling you if you watch the video, so, um, yeah. Um, so I thank you guys for watching this video. If you're watching this during the day, then have a nice day. And if you're watching this night, then good night. Have a good night's sleep, and I'll see you next time. Bye.